My name is Matt Rich. I'm the senior pastor here at Unity Presbyterian Church, and I want to welcome you to this week's edition of Life Together. This coming Sunday is August the 15th, and we will be celebrating a special day in the life of our congregation as we mark Blessing of the Backpacks. This is an opportunity we take each year at the beginning of the school year to offer a special time of reflection and prayer for our children, for our youth, and for all those who are engaged in the important ministry of education. We hope that you'll join us this Sunday at both of our services, 845 and the 11 o'clock service, as we mark this important time together. In addition to those prayers and moments of reflection, we'll also be passing out backpack tags. These are special tags that you can place on your backpack or your satchel or whatever else it is that you might be using to carry supplies back and forth that reminds you with a special scripture verse of our prayers for our children and our youth, as well as God's great love for us as we enter into this new school year together. So families with children and youth, I hope that you'll make a special effort to be with us this Sunday here at Unity Presbyterian Church, 845 or 11 o'clock. It'll be at both services. Come and join us for worship in person on Sunday. If you're not able to be with us but still would like to get one of those backpack tags, you've got two opportunities. One is that we'll have them available in a couple weeks at the annual meeting of the congregation which is on August the 29th at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So we'll have them available at that time. Also, you can contact Catherine McGregor, our Director of Christian Education, to make arrangements with her at another time that she might have them available to pick up as well. But I do hope that you'll be with us this Sunday, August the 15th. Speaking of this Sunday, we will once again, as I said, have our 845 and 11 o'clock services here in the sanctuary. Following the CDC guidelines, we are asking that everyone vaccinated and unvaccinated wear masks for all of our indoor uh, services and activities here at the church. And I appreciate your willingness to engage in that practice of health and safety once again. So thank you for that. We'll also be um, introducing at the 845 service the uh, time with children once again and also children in worship. So we're adding those back in as we begin to sort of be more engaged and more present with one another together here at the church as we move into the fall. I'll be preaching from Paul's letter to the Ephesians chapter 5. Uh, At the end of that chapter, verses 15 to 20, we hear Paul offering advice about Christian life and Christian living. We're going to think particularly about the relationship between being filled with the Holy Spirit and discerning God's will for us and how that might be related to wisdom. Certainly an appropriate topic as we think about the beginning of school. I hope that you'll join us, my friends. Please come and see us. We know that God is doing amazing and wonderful things, and you want to be a part of those. So we'll look forward to seeing you Sunday. God bless you, and we'll see you then.